everyone big paul back here for another video and um, it's monday um even though it's a bank holiday we're going to go in and check out some blue rays and see what we've got uh, i know we've got a couple out today we've got uh, underworld uh blood wars uh, and also triple x uh xander cage so let's head on into tesco's it's only going to be a short video this week uh, because i haven't got time to do all the alexa stuff this week so it's going to be a very short video but um let's go in and see what we've got Here we are at Tesco, so let's pop in there and uh, have a look at the Blu-rays and DVDs this week. So here's um, one of this week's big titles, uh, Triple X, uh, Return of Xander Cage uh, with Vin Diesel. I really like this film, uh, it's been slated quite a bit, but um, uh, the third film I thought it was quite good, especially like the ending where they had like a shootout in the uh, in the warehouse. Uh, it was a good old action flick there. Um, Underworld, uh, Blood Wars. I mean, this is like what film five or six. Um, it's nothing special anymore. It's just the same repetitive thing. It was all right for a watch, but um, I don't know if I'll be picking that up. Uh, Rings as well. Haven't seen this. Um, this is a uh, like a new version of uh, um, actual Ring. So I don't know. It's like a reboot, but. Um, I might pick it up. I'm not too hot in the horror film, so we'll see. And also, uh, they got the uh, the triple X one there in 3D. Different, slightly different cover on that, but uh, I didn't see it in 3D at the cinema, so it'd be interesting to see what the uh, what the 3D's like on that. And also the uh, the 4K edition as well, minus a slip. Naughty Tesco, slap your wrist. But yeah, as I say, I quite like this film. Um, I didn't think much of the second film, but um, the first one was brilliant. And is the uh, the DVD section here? Yeah, so here's the DVD section uh, with Triple X, uh, with a good cover on that one. And um, a bit of a slight change in the cover there. I don't know why there's there's two versions of it. And also uh, Natalie Portman and Jackie there. I really want to see this. This looks, this does look good. Wow, that's a good likeness of um, John F. Kennedy there, isn't it? And uh, Underworld. Bit of a silvery tint on, on the cover of that. I like that cover. Probably better than the Blu-ray cover. And rings there on DVD as well. And there's a couple of uh, new budget ones. Uh, Battle for Moscow. Uh, looks a bit like um, looks a bit like Fury, doesn't it, with Brad Pitt? Um, there, there doesn't seem to be any prices on some of these. And Fugitives as well with uh, Dominic Purcell. Yeah, that was quite good. And uh, thing there from. Uh, Avatar as well, but yeah, I think they've uh, missed out on putting some prices on. Uh, you can see that a lot, a lot of the cards are missing. Um, Max Two White House Hero. I didn't see the first one, but the second one, I don't know. That looks, I don't know. They also have the new series of Doctor Who, series ten. Well, it's not really. It's about series thirty or forty, isn't it? But what really pisses me off is that they decide to re release it in sort of like half seasons, like you know, part one and then part two when the rest of the series is done. But look, they charge like 23 quid. Just release the whole lot at the end, you knobs. Just gonna pop into another store that I haven't been to that many times before called B&M Home Store. Now they have a few toys and bits in there, so let's go. I've just come across these in B&M, um, Q-Pop, uh, which is kind of a, what a cheap knockoff maybe, uh, of, the, of the pop vinyl ones, but um, they look quite well constructed and really colourful so they've got you know they've got Batman there they've got Harlequin uh, and they're not just the standard pop kind of poses they're you know as you can see they're quite good poses um, but there's quite a few <laughs> there's quite a few uh, different ones uh, uh, there's no price tag so I think they're about three or four pounds so that's quite good 
Uh, and also, uh, you've got a Deadpool one here as well. He kind of like down on his knees on that one. But um, yeah, um, they, they do look quite good. I don't know how many there are. Uh, and also um, a couple of these uh, Batman it's, uh, metal die cast figures, which kind of look a bit like a pop vinyl, don't they? Uh, there's quite a few there. I presume just from Batman v Superman. Uh, nice Wonder Woman. That looks really good, actually. That looks quite good. Um, I'm off to see Wonder Woman uh, tomorrow, so um, I'll let you know what I feel. But um, it's getting some really good reviews. Uh, and also um, uh, a big big Batman figure there for 3 dollars uh, part of the Batman v Superman range. And also down here they've got um, a really nice Wonder Woman figure. This is, this is huge. This is really big, this figure. Uh, but it looks like they do the whole series of uh, Batman v Superman. Uh, so it's got Wonder Woman there and um, I think we've got Batman behind there as well. Yeah, in his, his metal gear. So yeah, they look really good, they do. Here's a few more of those figures that, um, one of the uh, ones I got for my birthday uh, a couple of months ago, uh, which was the, um, the Joffrey one, do you remember that I showed you in the, uh, in the tour of the back bedroom? Uh, but they've got a couple of other ones here. Uh, I'm not sure on the boxes, some of the boxes look a bit tampered on the back and uh, you've got some fingerprints and all that kind of shit, so I might need a good clean, but I think they're about £12.99, uh, which is kind of a reasonable price. I have seen a couple of these other ones, uh, a couple of other ones of these, a couple of weeks ago in some other store, but they were priced at about 25 quid, so um, yeah, I wasn't going to pick them up at that fucking price. But yeah, quite a few, and, and there's jo one Joffrey on his up. Hey everyone, back from the shops. A uh, couple of good titles out this week. Um, my memory's going to fuck, I can't remember what would come out this week. What the fuck? Yeah, anyway, those titles that you saw just now. <laughs> As you saw there as well, I checked out a new store called B&M, which is a home store, but they got a lot of toys in there and um, a few DVDs, but uh, mainly like a, a garden place and things like that. Some good uh, Superman and Batman stuff. So uh, yeah, that's really, that's really good. Um, and they're quite cheap as well. So um, thanks for clicking on the video. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you think it's all right. Uh, and maybe next week I'll remember what the fuck we're looking at. <laughs> <laughs> and don't forget for, to subscribe and um, I'll see you on the next video. Has anybody found my fucking memory? I can't remember where the fuck I've parked. <laughs>